Yeah, he's definitely relatively comfortable in the matchup. That's how he's going to be really big in this matchup. He's trying to, trying to keep you out with like as much as he can. Yeah, take that turn. Yeah, so like you are saying, it's just the mini game of weaving around villager aerials until you get in and then making up the percent. A lot of patience you need, like. Yeah. You have to give it up to me. Like, so much patience, especially, like, to play a game five. Um, in this kind of matchup is, like... And I know Mute's complained before uh, a lot about, like, having to deal with the checkout characters and speech and all that. But sticking with it, Mute still has a good character. All right, yeah, Mute's doing also uh, really well right now. Only 31% on him. Out. Yeah. And doing a really good job of keeping a uh, pickpocket a ledge. Obviously, villagers comfortable, more comfortable than most characters a ledge, but he's still taking full advantage of it. Really good using that throw invincibility to make sure he doesn't get hit by the ledge. Not going to do too much now because he's at 40 percent but that yeah. they're going to do it. Probably not ready to DI that because I uh, didn't think it was going to be other way. I think either way, even with good DI, he still might have died. But but Mute is only at a 69 percent, and uh, if he can. He gets a hit in. Yeah, if he gets a hit, then it's the full stock lead. Because this isn't like the the type of matchup where stocks can trade pretty fast. It's like stocks go one by one. Slowly. Yeah, except for the occasional random F smash like from a platform. Yeah. Or mute pulling two stitches. Yeah, but villager doesn't have like very many just like random raw kill moves. Back it's throw. more so harder for villager, like in that sense of like making the, the stocks go by faster. Yeah, you can al you also see sometimes a uh, Lloyd rocket, like the uh, basically the startup of it. If you contest it, it has like a stronger hitbox. What we got here. That traps are probably where you're gonna get a lot of mileage off that. I like that he used like the the tree springing up to to boost him towards, so you can cover like the regular getup range. Yeah, putting the tree uh, about roll distance. I'm sure. I'm not like sure, but uh, I would imagine that you can probably place it around roll distance to force a roll get up to be a little bit closer to the ledge than it normally would be. Ooh, and yeah, that's definitely stock. So, not too horrible. It's looking a little rough though. Yeah. It definitely gets his decent damage in. Floating right over the uh, the tree, and now a full stock lead and stitch. He goes for a lot of that pivot grab um, to try to catch mutes like landings with aerials and you're aware of it. Speaking of the stitch. Yeah, it's also really, it, even though he has stitch in hand against villagers, it's a lot more dangerous just because he has pocket, which That's is like pretty non-committal. I mean, it's not non-committal, but as far as like attempting to grab oh. stitch. And now oh. he's pocketed it, it's going to be That's probably a one-hit kill. And if not, it's going to do like 60-something damage just from pulling it out and throwing it. I'd imagine it's pretty hard to hit a Peach with a... Okay, never mind. Doesn't even matter. Yeah, didn't even get a chance to use it. Yeah, you know, it would be if Peach couldn't pull out a turn if that'd be pocket ones. That'd be that'd like make this matchup infinitely worse. I mean, Rob can't pull a gyro if that's pocket. Yeah. yeah, but Rob can only have one gyro. Peach can have multiple that's turn ups out. Same thing with, like, Diddy Banana. Pikachu or can't like, shoot T-Jolt anymore. That'd be crazy. Snake camp, snake camp, pull grenades. Uh, Palutena can't shoot auto reticle anymore. That'd be so good. <laughs> no, you can't pocket that. If you could. What would it do? You just do it in place? You just throw out a flame on your body? That'd actually be really bad for that matchup because explosive flame messes a villager up. That'd be really bad. If, if you, you couldn't throw on? Yeah. You're hearing this, Sakura? We're giving you ideas. <laughs> And I'm gonna pick up villager. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to throw it anyway. It it basically kills me at like 40 if he pockets it. So it's like not worth it using it unless it's like out of a combo. Or he's off stage. Yo, DZ can't throw. Gordo. Gordo? Ooh. Isabel. <laughs> what? He does have an Isabel, which is almost villager. I would say, yeah, I would say side B, especially in this matchup, is worse. Down B is uh, 
Also worse because float like this like makes it irrelevant. Ah uh, no. This is animal abuse. Call PETA. Ooh, stage spike. Nice tech. Has he done this before? Switch to Isabel? No. Not against mute, He's but. Experimenting. I, I didn't agree, but we'll see. I've the seen way it's been going so far. I've seen him play a Isabel in pre bracket friendlies on the stream setup. If that counts. <laughs> I'm so used to to forward throw being so much stronger in melee. Uh. Yeah, forward throw is a lot. Forward air good. though. Yeah. They gave that some. They gave that steroids in this game. Yeah, it was even stronger in Smash Four. Like. And he got nerfed. Yeah. yeah. You know, how sad me wasn't like on nerfed. Initially, yeah. Poppy didn't die from a forward air like 80%. You guys it's like, imagine. it's like, well, imagine that. Imagine that. It does. It does make Peach have a, a bit more trouble killing without like uh -huh. as strong of a uh, fair. Yeah, yeah, she still does a lot of damage and gets you to like kill percent relatively easily. But I can see against other characters that do the same thing how that would make the uh, matchups harder. Can you quote me on this, but I feel like the Isabel's dash attack is like better than Villager. I to, might just like send at a better angle. I actually don't know. She can lead into like fair strings off her dash attack. Yeah, I'm not sure. The same for Villager. They look very similar. Yeah. Like they both throw a pot at like the same angle. I just don't know if uh, if the knockback is the same. Why go this is though? Like... I honestly don't know. I think the main two differences in the... Uh, I mean, honestly... There are more than two differences, like Smash Attacks also. Yeah. Winky yeah, Face, like anything that's not a regular Smash does a stupid amount of damage. I think all of the differences are negatives yeah, exactly. in this matchup. That's what I'm yeah. Like the down B, I think, is at, at best the same, like, as far as like how good it is in the matchup, which is to say that they're both, like, not very good. Like, both Tree and. Uh, and the grounded, like, burying uh, Lloyd. Isabel's might be better just because it's faster, but, like, still. That's not that much of a difference. Down throw at four Ooh. fares. But dot eyes, yeah, that's that's 22. Already at 150, last stock. Yeah, Literally any good hit. Yeah. Will cancel Naren to dash away side B? What you gonna do? You gotta jump, but, like... Yeah. But, like, do you want to jump against Peach? You don't. Like, so what are you gonna